Hey there, Sharon Hornells from here, but you can call me Pajama Grandma. In case we haven't met yet, go ahead and put a hashtag pajama in the comments below. So it's the first time you're being exposed to the Pajama Grandma. Today is day 310 of the Daily Scare Share. This episode, I want to talk about swimming or standing. What are you going to do? Swim or stand? What does that even mean? Well, in this little book, Do One Thing a Day That Scares You, we have been looking at for 309 days, today's 310, what we can do to stretch our comfort zone to get us out of maybe the rut that some of us might have been living in, like me, or out of our comfort zone. Because everything we want in our life usually is just outside our comfort zone. It's just a little bit of a reach for us. And if we want that, we need to be willing to stretch our comfort zone and go for it. So in this book, every day, we've done a little bit every day so far, almost this entire year, to stretch our comfort zone. Think of things differently. Look at the world and get a different perspective on things because sometimes all we need to do to stretch our comfort zone is to look at things differently, ask a better question. Well, today is a sayings day. We're back to the sayings days. And it says, handy dandy magnifying glass, in matters of style, swim with the current. In matters of principle, stand like a rock. Now, I was fascinated when I used my magnifying glass to find out who actually said this. It was actually Thomas Jefferson. Thomas Jefferson said this. That is how wise and how long standing this wisdom has been available to us human beings. Yet, most of us never listen to it. In matters of style, swim with the current. In matters of principle, stand like a rock. So, to me, that means there's some things that it's cool and you should be with the times and change. Like, maybe your hairstyle. Like, maybe my hairstyle should come out of the 80s. Just saying. Or your fashion, you know, maybe my pajamas should come into the 2000s, but I'm, you know, a pajama grandma, so I like my flannel wild colored pajamas. But on when it comes to principles, with your values, your core beliefs, the things that you believe in at your core, not, not political beliefs or, or certain things like that, those things can change with information and time and data and, and things like that. But your core beliefs, your values, your principles, your morals, the things that you stand for that are really important to you, those should never change. Those should be something that you hold fast to. For example, in relationships, we all have values and core beliefs of how relationships should be. Think of your um, primary intimate relationship, for example. Some people believe that those should be monogamous and that's their core belief and fidelity is a huge thing. Other people, not so much. So, you need to be true to yourself and consistent and stand like a rock in your beliefs, for example, of relationship fidelity or loyalty or hard work, whatever those things are for you. So that's it. But your swimsuit style, I guess I like to think swimsuit style. Go ahead, change that up. Fashion, change that up. Hairstyles, you know, a lot of things come and go that are surface things and those just don't matter what really matters is who you are inside and the experiences that you have and what you bring as a human being the rest of it all of that can change in an instant and it's really not that important so nobody really cares if I have 80s hair except for my daughter that's it have a fantastic day I will see you tomorrow with day 311 of our daily scare share and it looks like it's another saying stay but without my magnifying glass I can't see it so I will read it to you tomorrow have an awesome day. Don't be scared. You got this.